Today I am going to focus on some of the points related to chemical equation and chemical reaction. Very simple point we have to understand this. We should not ignore this. What are these points? Look at this. Chemical equation, chemical reaction, reactants and reactants of chemical reaction, products of chemical reaction, method of writing chemical equation in which word equation, formula equation and balanced chemical equation. Let's talk about them. Chemical equation, what it means? The equation which represents a chemical change shortly is called chemical equation. It means just like this. When hydrogen, hydrogen when combines with oxygen, then they form water. This is a chemical change because hydrogen and oxygen are completely different than water. Hydrogen bonds itself. I mean to say this is combustible gas. This is uh, this helps in combustion, but when they combine to form water, water neither uh, the combustible nor it um, uh, helps to uh, helps to uh, helps on burning. It is uh, it is used to uh, to extinguish the fire. It means this change is a chemical change, and the chemical change is shortly represented by this equation, and that's why this is called chemical equation. Now, what is chemical reaction? Chemical reaction means uh, it is the interaction, the interaction that is the dissociation or and reunion of atoms and molecules of the elements or compounds, elements and compounds, which brings chemical change. It's called chemical reaction. It means interaction between what? Interactions. Uh, that means what? Interaction of atoms and molecules how do they interact they dissociate and they again reunite with each other to form a different types of element different compounds and this is called chemical reaction and that's why we can write the chemical reaction this way also hydrogen as to oxygen O2 when they uh, react with each other in chemical reaction what happens hydrogen dissociate with each other this molecule dissociate and forms atoms oxygen also dissociate and forms atom and these atoms recombine with each other and forms what on the compound with this water and that's why we can say the interaction that means the dissociation and reunion of the atoms and molecules of the elements or compounds which brings chemical change is called what chemical reaction now what is reactant of chemical reaction the elements or compound which takes part in the chemical reaction are called reactants look at this in this chemical reaction hydrogen and oxygen are taking part in the chemical reaction that's why they are reactant and what is the product of chemical reaction product of chemical reaction means the element or compound which forms after the chemical reaction is called product of chemical reaction look at this in this reaction lastly what formed water formed water is the product but product may be one or two or three maybe more than one here product is only one it means the product means the result of the chemical reaction is actually the product now method of writing chemical equation how do we write chemical equation there are three major methods which are used on writing the uh, chemical equation. The first is word equation, second is formula equation, and third is balanced chemical equation. Now, what is word equation? When the elements or compounds uh, are represented by words, in the chemical equation then that is called word equation look at this this is a chemical equation in this chemical equation element is element and compound both are written in words that's why this is the example of word equation but what the meaning of formula equation formula equation means when the elements or compounds which takes part in the chemical reaction and which forms after the chemical reaction are represented by their symbol or molecular formula then the chemical equation is called formula equation this is formula equation yeah 
uh, hydrogen is represented by its molecule, oxygen is represented by its molecule, and water is represented by its molecule. That's why this is the second time formula equation. Now, at last, let's talk about balanced chemical equation. This is the last one. When the when the uh, atoms number of atoms of each of the element in the side of reactants is equal to number of atoms of each uh, of the same element in the product then that type of reaction is called balanced chemical equation just for example look at this this hydrogen when reacts with oxygen then they form what water now uh, number of oxygen in both the sides are not equal here only one atom of oxygen is present in product side but in the reactant side we have two but reactant side we have two oxygen one two if we take here two then oxygen number of oxygen is balanced in both the sides and hydrogen we have four and if we take here two then hydrogen is also balanced this way this is balanced chemical equation it means this is word equation everything is represented in words whether element or compound this is formula equation not balanced but everything is written in in the uh, in the form of symbol and molecular formula and this is the balanced chemical equation where the number of atoms of particular element in the side of reactant is equal to the number of atoms of the same element in the product side and this is called balanced chemical equation okay this much for today